Hey, what's up? You know what we didn't get? We didn't get Starlight Blue Eyes, okay? We didn't get specifically this Starlight Blue Eyes. Okay, let me get a better example. Okay, that's a little, it's gross. It's my dirty rug. We didn't get this Blue Eyes in Starlight Rare, okay? We saw the Legendary Collection 25th Anniversary box feature the Stone Tablet Blue Eyes Quarter Century Rare, which is basically a Starlight Rare. Okay, not the same. Not the same as old girl here. We need this. This is the original art blue eyes. Some people call it that. I don't call it that. I call it SDK art blue eyes, okay? SDK, seen it in the Duel Monsters anime. Okay, that's my thing, okay? That's what I call it. That's what we call it. That's what it should be called. SDK art blue eyes. Now we need that thing in Starlight Rare. We didn't get it. We were teased in Battles of Legend Crystal Revenge, we were literally thinking that it was gonna be in there. Okay, I was convinced. Other people hinted at it. What? Sub YouTube. We were all feeling like it was coming to the TCG. We saw what the OCG got, which was a weird feature in the Animation Chronicles 2022, which is where they make cards from the anime come to life. Try to make it actual real effects going on here, make the mechanics work. So everybody can live out their favorite anime style deck, right? <laughs> In there, I don't think they got a Starlight set of Exodia, okay? So I guess that was a trade-off. That's what we got. And since then, that's been really hype. I think that's a topic all on its own. But for the Animation Chronicles 2022, they got the Starlight Rare Blue Eyes. But what was funny about it was the flavor text. It was in English, red, white. What did it read? It read like, super rare card. Like it was a, straight up from an abridged line, okay? Shout out to Little Karibo. Check out Little Karibo. The title, every letter was the same size, which usually doesn't happen, okay? It's usually the first letter that's bigger. It was really weird. Uh, you know, people pulled it. Several yu tubers pulled it. That was cool, but it's not, it, it's just not the same. You know what I mean? For TCG collectors, we need the back to look like that, okay? It's English, usually signifies English cards, you know? But yeah, we were teased heavily. And two weeks ago from the time of this video, we saw at YCS Los Angeles, we saw them tease the 25th anniversary stuff. So we got the legendary collection like we said earlier. But are they gonna give us anything more other than the five sets, as well as the modern sets they're set to release with the 25th anniversary stamp. Now there's one set so I think has 25 starlights or 25 quarter century rare. So that's gonna be insane to see what they're doing with all these sets with the 25th anniversary stuff. But are we gonna get any reprints of the Yugi's legendary decks. Would the SDK blue eyes be a starlight rare? Would it be a quarter century rare? Oh my God. Could they reprint the starter deck Kaiba? Starter deck Yugi, starter deck Joey? The possibilities are endless. So let me know what you think.